The Rafale F3A will come into service in 2019 after an experimentation phase by the Air Force. Its mission includes air defense and air superiority, all-weather deep strike, close air support, tactical and strategic reconnaissance, penetration including very low altitude terrain and nuclear deterrence. The Naval Rafale is a multi-role fighter aircraft capable of long-range missions with in-flight refueling. It is an adaptable asset design for a wide range of missions, such as air defense and air superiority, all-weather deep strike, close air support, tactical and strategic reconnaissance, anti-shipping mission, penetration including very low altitude, terrain and nuclear deterrence. The Mirage 2000D is an air-to-ground attack aircraft used in all the war operations of the French Air Force. The midlife upgrade of the Mirage 2000D was launched at the end of 2015 and aims to provide the aircraft with the technical capabilities needed to pursue its mobilization in support of the Rafale, especially for crisis management missions. The Mirage 2000D midlife upgrade program consists mostly in the replacement of the air-to-air missile Magic 2 by the Mica I Air, the integration of an air-to-ground gun carried in a pod at the front left of the aircraft to add a new capability to the French Air Force for CAS missions, the treatment of obsolescence and the upgrade of the M2000 flight simulators and trainers for the crew. The attack version of Tiger helicopter carries out combat operations by day or by night in any environment against ground target or slow aerial targets. Thanks to its high speed and its maneuverability, the Tiger meets the requirements of stealth and survivability. Equipped with air-to-ground missiles, the Tiger carries out tactical flights and actively contributes to current conflicts. This aircraft represents significant firepower support to troops engaged in overseas operation theaters. Its missions include area or axis reconnaissance, attack in coordination with ground forces, fire support for ground troops, long-range attack and assault. The Joint Forces Light Helicopter Program aims to provide the three armed forces with a single fleet of helicopters to replace the five fleets they currently operate in service since the 70s for the longest serving fleet. The French Army's Gazelle, the French Navy's Alouette 3, Dauphin and Panther and the Air Force's Fennec fleet. The H-160, the latest civilian addition to the range of Airbus helicopters, was chosen in 2017 to be militarized. Its missions for French Army include participation in the engagement of air ground combat, armed reconnaissance missions, close air fire support, infiltration of small specialized units. For the French Navy, anti-surface warfare, naval force protection, state sovereignty missions, surveillance of maritime approaches and intelligence gathering, and maritime rescue. For the French Air Force, protection of national airspace, search and rescue, including combat search and rescue, and long-range combat missions, intelligence gathering and operations. The Pilatus PC-21 is the new training aircraft for fighters, pilots, and navigators and weapon system operators. The first class of pilot cadets and navigator weapon systems operator cadets will begin flights in June 2019. With its capabilities, it represents a real technological breakthrough and comes significantly closer to the latest generation fighter aircraft. Its onboard interactive simulation system provides a very high level of representativity of tactical missions.